not a good ABC's morale is poor due to the Amy Robach and TJ Holmes conflict as the stars consider leaving the morning show. TJ, 45, and Amy, 49, have been suspended from GMA3 and are preparing to leave the network. According to Page Six, the ongoing investigation into the former presenters is causing ABC employees a lot of stress and distraction. Insiders told the publication they are getting frustrated with Kim Godwin's management of the situation. Just days after their affair was revealed, Kim abruptly removed Amy and TJ from the air in December. It's been almost two months. A two-month tabloid frenzy has occurred. The location of the establishment is not ideal, according to the source. The source went on to claim, not so much the talent, but the spirit. The people who keep the lights on are the rank and file. Morale has never been lower. However, Kim defended herself, telling Page Six that she removed them on the air because their relationship had turned into an internal and external distraction. According to a source who spoke to the media, if the hosts returned to the show, Disney's reputation is in jeopardy. The couple wasn't dragged off straight away, and when they did, the co-hosts didn't address the problem, which left many GMA employees perplexed. They were permitted to continue hosting the show for a few more days after the co-hosts' affair became public knowledge, while they were live on air in late November. Why remove someone off the air after telling folks they didn't break any laws? It is illogical, except for her discrepancies, her behavior is inconsistent, according to an insider. According to the insiders, Kim is to fault for the messiness of the situation because she was really unsure of herself and is extending the drama. DeMarco Morgan, the stand-in host, allegedly felt unprepared for his new position. He was transported via overnight flight from Los Angeles to New York, and and he didn't know that's what he was there for. The insider alleged, according to a source who spoke exclusively with the U.S., son, Amy and TJ are preparing to leave the morning program and won't be coming back. Seven weeks after being removed on the air, the hosts of GMA3 are unofficially out, and their freshly hired legal teams are working with ABC's senior executives and attorneys to come up with a strategy for making a major statement. According to the insider, ABC's legal staff takes a very long time because they are a very tiny but well-respected group of lawyers. For Amy and TJ's escape plan, they are definitely checking their TS and dotting their is. Although the network insider is unsure of the specifics around the coupled-up co-host's future at the network, it's apparent they are not coming back to MA3, the insider said. Although nothing has been made public yet, an insider close to Amy and TJ said, they are unlikely to return to the network at all. ABC is going to pay a lot of money to make everyone happy and walk away very, very quietly. The network insider continued, ironclad NDAS will be signed, and their leave contracts will include everything necessary to prevent nuclear explosions in the aftermath. The ABC legal staff will have their work cut out for them to ensure everything is done correctly because of the way this whole matter was handled. Bob Iger, CEO of Disney, will definitely have eyes on the final packages, the insider added in assurance. Another person familiar with the talks also said that Amy and TJ's lawyers are currently in close communication with the network's legal team. All of them are figuring out ways to make the hosts feel at ease so that the network can go on as silently as possible. Amy and TJ think they're being fired from the network, as the U.S. Sun previously reported.